As you guys know, over the last few months, we have been talking a lot about people's favorite updates inside of Royal High. But one question I haven't asked you guys is about upcoming updates that are your favorites very, very soon. Now, obviously, I'm still a little bit sick, so please do excuse my voice. But today, I asked you guys to tell me what your favorite upcoming things are for the new school or updates for the new school, and you guys did not disappoint. <laughs> Hello wonderful little beans, my name is B and welcome back to my channel. Before we get started with today's video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell and of course use star code B when buying Robux or Premium. You guys, I need to ask a giant favor. As you know right now, Royal High content is not doing so hot on YouTube and so I'm working really hard on pushing my other channels. If it really does take just literally a second of your time to check them out, it would mean a lot to me if you could just go and have a look, see if you like the content, you never know, you might really enjoy it and then maybe you'll want to stick around on those channels as well it would mean a lot to me you guys there's so many options so please do go and have a look in the description for all the links to my other channels and thank you so much to everybody who does just so you know we are doing a robux giveaway on my most recent Bloxberg video on my roleplay so if you want to go reply to the comment on there of your robux username then obviously i will announce on this channel who the winners are like we always do thank you so much to everybody who's entered so far now that all means it's time for us to get started we are going to talk a little bit about the new school updates and what you guys are most excited about for when it releases. As you can see, I tweeted and said out of all of the updates we've seen so far, what do you feel is the best new school update that is coming in the future? Dorms, furniture, something else? Let me know. And as you can see, starting us off, Miss Rose Bella said detention dungeon. I mean, the idea is so cool that your actions have consequences and it's nice for role players too. Now, as you guys know, this is something we've thought about a lot over the last few months, ever since Hat, Roblox, and Dino originally shared those first pictures with us of those new dungeons and how they would work. Everybody has had so many curiosities and ideas about exactly what is going to work and actually function in regards to those dungeons. Now, naturally, everybody is very excited about it but we don't know exactly how it's going to work just yet but it does sound quite exciting so let's have a look at what those dungeons look like as you can see, this is an image here of the guard lounge and the dungeon area that Heart Roblox and, of course, Dina originally shared. We know inside there, there are some prison cells. There's various different areas to look around. And it looks as though there's going to be a lot of interesting things coming in terms of how this will function. Now, there are keys on the wall that we've seen in some screenshots and on the floors and things like that, too. We don't know exactly how it's going to work. Maybe if you don't complete your class and you get an F. Maybe if you don't do your homework for too many days or something like that you'll get detention and automatically teleported down or you never know maybe you'll actually end up by going into the game with players that are npcs or people that playing teachers for example being sent down into the dungeons which could be very interesting now, next up, Samantha said, I'm really excited for the voiced NPCs and the scepter making class along with the mini games, if there is, and chests along with the maze. I'm pretty sure you made a video saying there might be one. Yep, as you guys may remember, Lon said on one of his streams that there would be a maze of some kind inside of the new school when he was announcing those random words put together that we had to make guesses about. Also, the scepter making class was, of course, announced inside of Barbie's live stream, where in the description of one of the items, it said that you made it inside of scepter making class. And additionally, the actual first thing that they said, of course, which was the voiced NPCs. We know that Beffy VA, Coffee, Coffee's girlfriend, Mrs. Coffee, and very many other people as well, I'm sure, are going to be voicing types of NPCs inside of the new school. There's a lot of different things coming to the new school when it releases, and I'm excited for those, but the NPCs definitely will be interesting. It will be certainly interesting to find out if any of the current NPCs in Royal High's law will end up with some kind of voice added as well. Next up, Pixelated Mike said these four. Now, as you guys know, these are the four main mascots that are going to be utilized for the quest badges that we've seen or mainly when you level up badges so you know that there's the sophomore mermaid one there's the junicorn one which is the junior one then there's like the senior fairy one and of course the freshman which is the princess one we don't know exactly how these are going to work and in what order they are going to be officially other than the first two in the middle that we know are going to be the sophomore for the mermaid and the junior for the unicorn just because they're called sophomore mermaid and junicorn inside of the badges but these are going to be interesting to find out exactly what these characters are going to entail since we know obviously so far there's going to be some sort of law with them because they show up around the new school a lot 
And then All Star said the waterfall place Barbie shared on Twitter, like the outside of the school. Now, that waterfall place was actually one of the first places Barbie ever shared about the new school. So I don't think it's likely that it's still going to be in the new school when it comes out because it is one of the OG places we saw for the first time. I have a feeling it's probably going to be reworked by then. But this is the place that they are talking about, and this is from back in 2020 when Barbie was first showcased in the new school. Now, I don't know for sure if this campus will still remain, but based on the amount of time that's been by and we know that Barbie has already said that she's reworked a lot of things, I have a feeling this one probably has been changed. Ash said, I think the furniture, because it'd be really nice to see, and we can also have speed build videos in the new school, of course. Now, obviously, you guys will remember we've seen some really low quality screenshots like this one that have been dotted around for the new furniture, but this new furniture does look absolutely amazing. Heart Roblox has worked really, really hard on it, and I definitely think this is going to be one of the most exciting parts of the new school. Personally, for me, you guys, I think the most most exciting thing is going to be the meet and greet realm because it means that we're finally going to be able to meet and greet with you guys without all the added pressure of obviously people not being able to get into the servers, people not getting fair chances and all of those problems that we've experienced over the last few years while trying to meet our audience members. I think the meet and greet realm will really make changes and I'm really really excited about it. In the meantime while we wait for the new school though obviously there's lots of things we're excited about but I really 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 do. I am basically begging you guys to give my other channel a chance because I really really think you'll enjoy the content if you do at least try it out right now I don't want to quit Royal High you guys but I need to make sure something else is going well as well so if you could check out my other channels it really 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 would mean a lot to me you guys I would genuinely be so happy if you could check them out so thank you so much for considering it if you do I really do love and appreciate you guys so much thank you so much for watching everybody I really do appreciate it before we finish this video I just wanted to show you guys a quick clip of what's upcoming on my B Reacts channel in case you haven't subscribed yet because I really think you're missing out if you haven't. Here's a quick clip of my first reaction video that's going out on B Reacts this weekend so you guys can have a feel for the content you're going to get to watch when it first comes out. <gasps> Selena. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh dear, that does not look ideal. I hope you guys enjoyed that clip and I hope you're excited about the channel. If you are, please go and subscribe. Just search Be Reacts or just look in the description for the link. And thank you so much. I love you guys. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you all soon. Goodbye.